Hi, I'm Nikolai from Bunker Samples and I apologize for coming to you from my living room today. But we are in full on lockdown, so it's the best I can do. I wanted to show you the articulations in Bunker Strings Volume 2 so you can understand them better. And if you ever need to record with live players, you can instruct them. Anything with pulses in the name is basically a potato, not to be confused with potato. It's basically a soft bow accent, but all the players are playing their own random rhythms. So it sounds like this. So you can imagine when all the players are sort of speeding up and slowing down independently of each other, you get this very nice shimmering texture. The first of the pulses is a super soltesto, which means that it's played way over the fingerboard, very soft and has this very nice airy and slightly noisy sound. The second of the pulses is played much louder and half of the players are playing an octave above the rest. So half of them are playing and the other half. Then we have the tremolo bursts. The idea here is that the players are playing very short, randomly timed little bursts of tremolo. So you hear the tremolo sort of wandering around in the section. When they're not playing tremolo, they're just holding the note. So it sounds like this. The second of the burst is the same thing, but when the players play the tremolo burst, they very quickly move the bow down to the bridge, so you get a sulpont sound. Then we have the free plectrum articulation, which of course use one of these, a guitar plectrum or pick, depending on where you're from. It's basically a pizzicato and we actually held the violins and the violas like a guitar. Like a normal pitch would sound like this. But with the plectrum you get this. So it's like a pizzicato on steroids. The plectrum tremolo is exactly what you think it is. It's the same thing, just randomly timed. Plectrum strum uses a technique where you dampen the strings very lightly and then just strum all four of them. The key here is to not to press down too hard with the left hand because then you start to get an actual pitch. Just very lightly dampen the strings and strum away. I hope that was useful and I hope Bunker Strings Volume 2 will serve you well. See you soon. Bye bye.